hello guys today my video is about how to upscale a DVD <coughs> for this I have downloaded a 7 GB or what file I have downloaded 7.22 GB file I have downloaded from a website so here is the DVD here is the DVD's file inside inside the DVD you will see these files and <coughs> you have to uh, detect the um, you have to see that the resolution what is resolution and the audios and whatever inside the DVD click over right click on ri uh, first file and remember one thing that the first file is always 0 0.99 GB so right click over here and click on media info you have you can see the descriptions of the video over here and here it is 448 kps audio in this DVD and there is also a DTS audio 755 kbps all are 6 channel audio now let's begin how to upscale you have to download MEGUI from video help here is the MEGUI just open it and go to tools and click on AVS script creator or co press ctrl R then go to video input means the video you have to uh, the DVD you need to encode so here is the DVD and this is the DVD's file so here is the DVD's file so you have to select the first file means I just said that the first file is always 0 0.99 GB so click on the first file and click on open it will automatically detect the remaining files so you don't need to, you no need to um, select all these files just uh, select the first file and click on open and this window will appear click on fi file indexer and for extracting audios click over here or if you don't want to extract audio click over here I prefer if you are not professional then click on extract all audio or select the audio you want to extract uh, and if you and at last if you want the uh, want to max the aud encoded audio and this audio file together you have to select the audio which one you um, have to you want to uh, add in the encodes file so I want to add this DTS file after the encoding so I just unselect this top one this AC3 6 channel so that it doesn't it, it will not um, extract while um, encoding so then you have to click on Q it will take some time to extract as I am using SSD this process will be fast on my PC and if you are using hard disk or um, SSHD uh, it will take too long on your PC because hard disks have a disk it need to read and SSD is a flash drive it doesn't take time and this process will take some time and hold on I'll tell after this mm. okay it finished this window will appear after that process click on AVS this one this window click this is the AVS script creator this is the resolution part and this is the resize part and this is the crop part and this is the filters and this is script the professional encoder use the use their manual script to change their um, change the videos um, contest or sharpness or whatever he want to in want it in this video want to encode in this video so first my target is to upscale so how to upscale this video first of all you have to crop this black border from the top and below of this movie so you have to click on auto crop it will automatically crop this uh, top part and below part and uh, or you can crop it manually by clicking over here and you can click over this uh, top arrow button it will crop slightly 
so it will take time better I prefer click on auto crop but in here in case I can see in my view in the down part uh, it doesn't crop perfectly see there is a uh, I can zoom it but I can see uh, I think I can crop a little bit from the below so here is a below part I just I have to click on the uh, top arrow over here and it will crop automatically now it looks fine now click on mm, f filters here yeah. click on filters then analyze this analyze this movies mm, what is said I don't know uh, click on analyze it will automatically analyze the source type means uh, the movie source type you don't need to know that it is professional and as I am using SSD so this process will be also fast on my PC and remember while analyzing don't click anywhere in this AVS script creator cause AVS script creator will crash means MEGUI will crash after this process click on noise filter and prefer minimal noise only don't use heavy noise or little noise or minimal noise whatever just use minimal noise then click on script so you have to know the two things while encoding or upscaling videos in Bollywood movie and Hollywood movie the resolution and the expect ratio is different in a Bollywood movie the 720p resolu 720p resolution movie will be 1280 width and 544 will be height and in Hollywood 720p movie the resolution will be 1280 into 536 and for 1080p the Bollywood movie resolution will be 1920 in uh, 816 and for Hollywood movie 1080p resolution will be 1920 and 800 sorry 800 now you have to know the MEGUI script over here just you have to know one thing the langronized resize or this this one so you have to edit this part for upscaling the 720p is the width of the um, DVD and the 296 is the height of the DVD <laughs> after cropping I said I'm saying that so you have to edit this one means you can edit or write whatever you want in case in this case you have to write the resolution over here the format of the resolution you have to write is it uh, let me say first that this is a Bollywood movie so you have to uh, if you want to upscale in 720p you have to write 1280 comma 544 and if you want to upscale to 1080p you have to write 1920 comma 816 okay this is the process of upscaling so I don't think DVD is mm, good to encode in 1080p so better go for 12 in 720p that's the that's enough for a DVD so I prefer 1280 comma 544 and I just write over here for the example just delete this part and for professional encoder they use the professional encoding script to change the movie color movie depth movies sharpness and many things 
so i can't show this because i'm not uh, that type of professional encoder so just click on preview script and it will show the resolution and the upscaled um, just for viewing whatever you can and you uh, you can see this the upscale over here you can just play but no audio will come and you have to save this file now come to the audio encoding part okay after that saving this file that file this window will appear just close it if you want to encode this audio dts audio to whatever you want here is ac3 encoders there is encoder settings also you can use this uh, codec so if you want to encode audio so go to configure go to this video bitrate uh, sorry audio bitrate whatever you want to select select this uh, bitrates as i said i will not encode i want to match the dts audio in this file so i will not encode i will not encode the audios over here so i j will just delete this or um, just uh, remove the audio from the emigui so that it will not encode click over here it will uh, automatically remove this file and now come to the um, size part means after encoding what uh, what size you want to make so you have to again go to tools and go to bitrate calculator or press control v a window will appear so for measuring the size you have to select any of this file uh, this one so i just press randomly da 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 here mp4 ac whatever just it will not encode uh, it will not, uh, if you select this one it is just for testing purpose means this format will not come so i just uh, remember that the dts audio bitrate was 755 so i will write over here 750 right so it would automatically detect the size of the of the dts audio according to the movie length then click on total size and click over down arrow here and select custom size go to i want to make this uh, movie uh 4 gb so i will select over gb and type only 4 and press okay and it will automatically detect the video bitrate according to the size so here is a video bitrate 3026 click on apply and click on yes 3026 was the video bitrate so if you want to Mm, check the uh, what bitrate it comes i will tell that one bitrate will come or uh, less while encoding 3026 over there and it will detect 3025 so ignore it one bitrate is uh, you cannot detect anything if you decrease one bitrate so just ignore this i just uh, used manual settings you can see these settings for encoding this one don't see this one you will be confused just see this one and nothing else and press okay then you have to encode this audio uh, sorry encode this video so click on auto encode and this window will appear select no target size use profile settings means the settings i have used it will encode according to my settings so click on no target size click over mkv and name of output i just want to name it 720p dt sorry 720p upcoming dts au dio <laughs> cause i will going to mix this dts audio after the in, uh, after the movie encode so click on save and click on queue 
it will start encoding and remember that d never use this on your laptop cause your laptop is sophisticated and if you are not using a high-end PC never try to do this on your low-end PC cause if you are going to use this on your low-end PC your PC uh, sorry low-end laptop or any laptop or PC low-end you can damage your laptop any laptop or if you are uh, if you are not using high-end PC then heat will generate for a long time and it will damage your PC better never try on your low-end PC better always go for a high-end processor like i5 i7 Ryzen or Xeon processor never try on dual core or atom processor I, I am just telling this for safety purpose so here the video encode started it is the fast pass it take 124 fps and it is using 100 percent of my cpu after completing this another process will start so after encoding i will show you how to merge this file and where it will going to save i'm just uh, showing in this video that where the video will gonna save it is gonna save inside your dvds file here and over here you will find the video file over here the na name I have given I just forgot over here you can see yeah upcoming DTS 720p upcoming DTS audio you will find oh, this MKV file over here so in next video I will show you how to merge these audios and videos together and to make a perfect movie on your 720p resolution thank you thanks for watching